Welcome to my channel, Main Street Orlando. My name is Josie, and today we're here at Disney's Hollywood Studios to check out all the latest Disney merch. Let's go. begin at Celebrity 5 and 10, but this time let's go in by the dark room side. We have a new pins and look at this limited release haunted mansion pin and it looks like I don't know an art piece don't you think and this one here is $30 over here we have focus focus I believe focus focus is celebrating its 30th anniversary and this one is $18 another hocus pocus limited release this one is very large $35 they must have run out of this one behind the counter but they have this new pin welcome foolish mortals and it is also limited release these light up grogu ears i mean look how fun that is it looks like an acrylic material on the ears let me try them on for you they are 22 dollars now it is a little tight on the head and look at that just make sure you don't poke anybody's eye out Take a look at these Chip and Dale keychains. So this is Dale, they are $15 each. There's a little nut there. And here's Chip. Let's see if he has the same nut. Yep, so cute. I've showed this Peter Pan mug before with the mermaids. It's so cute. And this one here is $20. There's Peter Pan merchandise arriving to the parks. And we have Emma here with us today. And look at this, we have another Peter Pan mug and it is, it looks like a wood, right? We have a Peter Pan, Michael, we have John, Tinkerbell, and Wendy, darling, how nice, $20. Oh my goodness, we have a new Munchlings. This is from Specialty Treats. It is orange cream taffy Chuby with Candy's plush. And Chuby is a little bird at the end of the Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway ride. How adorable is this one? And let's see how much this is, $20. Right across the street is Disney and Co. or Mickey's of Hollywood. Let's check it out. Take a look at this Ursula spare jersey. I mean, come on, it's Ursula. Look at that design. She looks so evil and those dark colors. She may be the key to Triton's undoing. And then look over here, we have this, I would say iridescent puffy print. Yeah. And then the front side, we have Flotsam and Jetsam with that iridescent Walt Disney World logo. And let's check it out. Okay, a mysterious price, but it might be anywhere between $75, $90 or so. Walt Disney's Mickey Mouse in Steamboat Willie shirt. Now these shirts are $30, and when you get two, you can buy them for $25 each. They already have a Halloween t-shirt. Well, we saw the, I would say Halloween pins, because Haunted Mansion, Hocus Pocus. What did you say? Halloween. Yeah, Halloween. Halloween. Yeah, what did I say? Halloween. Halloween, okay. So anyhow, Halloween, the party is early this year. In August? August. Yeah. So I think that is why we're seeing Halloween merchandise already. So yeah, they have this shirt. And then please tell me what this is, because I'm a little lost. We have a snowman. It says, Nick Knack, Sunny Egypt, Sunny Palm Springs, so Sunny Florida, Sunny Death Valley, and Surf Death Valley. Okay, I know 
obviously Florida, Palm Springs, Egypt, all those things, but what does this mean? By the way, any merch items showed in this video also available on shopdizzy.com. I will link down below in the description box so you can shop as well. It is an affiliate link, but you are not charged more or less by shopping through the link. It simply helps the channel. Another way you can help a channel is by giving this video a like and subscribe for more Disney World merch updates. We have made it to Star Tours. Well, you know where we are going. A lot of people get dizzy on this ride or like really lightheaded. It doesn't really do much to me, maybe because I look away most of the time. Does it make you dizzy? Sometimes, depending on the adventure that you're putting. The depending on the screen. adventure. I mean, my trick is that I look what's on screen, then I look, I look out, then I look back, Sometimes then I look out. The, the lenses. Or you and could I take help. the glasses. Yeah, the glasses. They, they I mean, looking out, it does. You miss a lot of things, but I guess it helps you not get dizzy. I mean, you choose. A new weighted plush, and he is absolutely adorable. I love that pastel color green on Grogu. Of course, the face is probably not my favorite but he's still very cute and then look at that i've never seen grogu's feet i mean you can never always his rope goes all the way down and he looks like he's tripping over his robe but anyhow this one here is let's see 40 dollars or and those little trick here is that we uh, put the robe over his feet <laughs> A Star Wars The Clone Wars Clone Trooper Phase 2 mask or electronic helmet, let's say, yes. And this is actually by the brand Hasbro. Let's see what else. It electronically distorts wearer's voice and sounds like a Phase 2 Clone Trooper. And the price on this one is $140. There seems to be a new Grogu collection. And I've said before, they do a lot of Grogu merch for kids, but now they've added adult stuff and I'm really happy about that. So this, I love the neutral color on it. It is a sweatshirt. It's really hot outside, but in a few months when it gets cold, we're gonna really appreciate this and thank ourselves. So look at this, it's a quilted design and then Grogu right up front. It looks kind of like a, I don't know, like a terry cloth like a terry material. Cloth, like a, I don't know what like to call it. Yeah, and then I love the quilted design. And then look at the inside, just like the outside. Let's get the price on this one. And it is, oh gosh, here we go, 55. And if you didn't know, you can purchase Legacy Lightsabers here at the Tatooine Trader Store, which is really nice. Another item from this collection, a little bag, and this is a faux leather material bag. And then it says here in this little patch, tap, tap, tap. So adorable. You guys know this scene. I adore this scene. All right but they have this little coin purse on the side that says Star Wars. Let's get the price on this. The strap even says Star Wars. Let's get it, let's get it. $40, not bad at all. I wonder if the inside is a different color. Okay, it's a little neutral color design. I love neutral color, yay. And I've showed you guys before how they have a new collection for Star Wars. They have some over here where it's kind of like at the World of Disney it was that we showed it. And it is very simple and I am obsessed. Look at this, this one is very simple. I love the neutral color here, Star Wars embroidered on the pocket. It is $39.99. It is a very cold, I like that. Oh, oh, with some arabesque on there. It's like a cold to the touch fabric. And it has a specific patch. Where is it? Right here. So that's the patch on the new collection. You get the arabesque alphabet. You can match that shirt with this bag, which they've had a, for a while here. Another Grogu hoodie. And this one is in puffy print Star Wars. I'm here to see the kid. I'm here to see the kid. 
Oh yes, and look at him over his shoulder. Okay, this is adorable. It's a black hoodie and it is $55. May the force be with you in puffy print. And we have a design of the back side of the characters. We have Mandalorian, Ahsoka, R2, and Grogu. And I believe this is all from the scene from Boba Fett when Mandalorian went to go look for Grogu. And this is $40. We just went through an, a random awkward moment where a guest, it was so random. Um, I'm showing you guys the shirt and a guest just came out of nowhere and made fart sounds like really close to me. I don't know if he was trying to make, or she was, was it a she? It was a she, right? Yeah. Where she was trying to be funny in the camera, but I don't think you guys picked it up. So let me know if you picked it up. You guys can recognize this entrance. Let's go check out Galaxy's Edge. next to Rise of the Resistance, there is this merch stall here and I've never noticed this shirt or probably it's new, Black Spire Outpost. Okay, and some arabesque. Let's get the price on it. It's cream colored. Okay, mysterious ripped price. Maybe 35. But then let's get the patch. Okay, we have a little patch here. Let's see if there's anything on the back. Okay, but I like the cream color. Very for nice. Summer. Yeah, good for summer, exactly. Okay, this tank top has a hoodie. It has a hoodie with some arabesque on it and it's embroidered in orange. And then we have a resistance right here. It says resist. Let's see the price on this, $45. A Rise of the Resistance magnet and it has a resistance pilot helmet on there. It's metal. And it's, yeah, it's like heavy metal and it is $15. Another pilot helmet shirt here and it says resist. Like look at this patch here, resist. The shirt is cream colored and oversized, but it's supposed to give you like that very natural look, if you know what I mean. I mean, this is a size medium. Let me get my size. Never mind, they don't have my size, but it's supposed to be a tunic style top and it is $40. And this tank top that says join the resistance in the same color. Check this men shirt out and it has an X-wing right there. It's from that same resist collection. I really like the patch here. It is $37. $37. It gives it like, it's a very natural looking collection. This is the back side with the um, Black, Spire. Black Spire Outpost logo. And then look at this, class Starfighter, da -da 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 -da. the matching hat for $30. It has two patches, the Resist patch and the Black Spire Outpost patch. I like that they have the kid sizes in the same collection. This one here is $27 with the, um, I was going to say the TIE Fighter, with the X-Wing. And then over here, this one is $32 with the helmet. Let's go inside the mall, aka the marketplace. If you need a little companion here, I won't promise you that he'll be friendly, but monkey lizards, 40% off. You can get these matted prints here. Look at this one that says the Millennium Falcon. And then there's Batu and the Cantina with DJ Rex. I wonder what these, okay, so, oh, $15. Okay, I was gonna say mysterious price, but they're $15 each. For $30, they have this very interesting hat here. It has the Black Spire Outpost patch on there. And then look at the inside. So this will definitely help with the sun, but let's try it out. I mean, I've never seen such a thing. Okay, this string is supposed to come up front. What do you think? Very cool keychain. It kind of looks like the coasters you get over August Cantina. Oh, the same design of right? The I think yeah. so. And it is $15. So on one side you get August Cantina, and on the other side is the Black Spire Outpost logo. We all know ML hates hats, but I'm gonna make him try it on. Yeah, the hair. Just go put it on. Let's see. Tie it. Tie it down there how it's supposed to be done. 
You're making us wait, sir. There you go, there you go. Okay, tip your head forward so they can see. Okay, this is a pretty cool hat. I mean, let me know in the comments if you, oh, style, fashion. Let us know in the comments if you would wear this. The latest Batuan fashion. I'm low key obsessing over this hat. It even has a little adjustable piece. This print is really nice because it's actually very large. It says Black Spire Outpost matted with some Arabesh. Docking Bay 5. I love it. Let's see the price on it. Hopefully it says the price. Maybe oh no! Points. Galaxy's Edge. Okay. It's $59 and usually these I love to just buy the frame. And it looks really good on the wall and you get to get it already wrapped. Like they have them in these uh, black papers so that it doesn't get scratched up. Toy Story Land and this block here. Isn't that the kingdom of Corona's son? You know, Rapunzel? Rapunzel. Okay, Emma and I decided to compete here at Toy Story Mania. Let's see who's the winner. This is honestly a never ending competition with this ride. Just a little secret Emma always wins. No, once you win. Win! Once. I don't remember. You, he always wins. So we'll see what happens this time. All right, I think we're ready. ready. <laughs> I don't spend my energy on the practice game. I'm trying to save it. Of course, of course, of course. But at least I got more accuracy. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm really bad in accuracy. Let's see what's new over at the Legends of Hollywood, which is located right next to Tower of Terror. And look at that. They have a Pandora store in here. And look what they have. They have a Little Mermaid collection that's new. This is from the Little Mermaid live action and they have a variety of charms. I'm gonna show you up close and their pricing. The little conch shell here is $85, the one that treasures her voice. And over here we have the aerial charm for $75. We have a pair of ear earrings for $95. This one represents Ursula and it is $70. We have other varieties like this one with the fish and the coral for $70. The Sebastian one is $70. And by what I see, you can actually use these charms not just in your Pandora bracelet, but also as a necklace or even as earrings. This is another example of how they use them as earrings. I really like that. It's like an extension of a hoop earring. Check out this necklace. Okay. This illustration or photo here kind of shows you a little bit better. So this is the one that was the Ursula charm, the Ariel charm. And then this is the one with the uh, conch shell with the coral and the fish. I didn't notice it had pink rhinestones and it says under the sea. And the ring which represents Ursula has kind of like an octopus tentacle there. Isn't that cool? Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget about those Shop Disney links down in the description box. Subscribe for more Disney World merchandise, tours, updates, and fun, and Universal Studios as well. What really helps the channel is if you give this video a like, questions or comments, leave them down below, and also hit that notification bell so you're notified every time we upload a new video. And if you wanna see the video prior to this one where I go to Disney's Epcot, we check out the latest merch, we walk around Road Showcase, visit Canada Pavilion, Mexico Pavilion check it out right up here or the one prior to that one where we visit the Disney outlet store the Disney character warehouse and the days of Christmas over at Disney Springs check out the Christmas merchandise Christmas ornaments the new ones that just came out right down here and I cannot wait to see you guys again very soon bye